What's up guys? Jake here. And uh, I believe last episode we said we were going to start on Paradise. And start on Paradise we are. It's Dr. Martin. Wait, do I have all the stuff I need before I get started? <laughs> I've done... Let's see. There's probably a bit of stuff I could sell. Thing is, do I need to sell anything? <laughs> yeah, okay, I, I need to grab a few things. I'll be back. Okay. Sold some shit, now uh, let's get started. I have everything in place for the ritual. I'll open the portal whenever you're ready. I don't know what you'll find in Cameron's paradise. I do know the portal I create through the Mysterium Xarxes ritual will close behind you. You'll have to find another way back. Oh, that's reassuring. I believe that Manka Cameron acts as the anchor for paradise. Just as a sigil stone anchors an oblivion gate in place. Kill Manka Cameron, and you will unmake his paradise. Shall I open the portal to paradise? Are you ready? Yes, open the portal to paradise. Farewell, my friend. Our fate is in your hands. Bring back the Amulet of Kings. Brace yourself. Alright, time to save. I think he still hates me for accidentally killing someone. Like you can tell by how badly he makes frowny faces at you. Yeah, he's still making frowny faces. Hmm. Whoa. Cool. Alright, let's do this. Looks like a pretty nice place, right? Wrong. Bad things happen here. These are all mythic dawn so, guys. The cat's paw of the septim arrives at last. You didn't think you could take me unawares here of all places in the paradise that I created. Yeah, he gets to uh, shit talk you while you're. Uh, man, I need to go, go scorching while I'm dealing with these guys. Look now upon my paradise. Gaia Alata in the old tongue, a vision of the past and the future. So I'm going to try to stop talking when, uh, so you can hear what, uh, Mr. Cameron says. Whoa! Okay. Blue man can jump, apparently. Now, basically from what I've seen, or from what I remember, Behold the savage garden, where my disciples are tempered for a higher destiny. To rule over Tamriel Reborn. <coughs> if you are truly the hero of destiny, as I hope, the garden will not hold you for long. You hope? <coughs> so he hopes that I kill him. This is getting confusing. Hello. Wait. You're not gonna... You're not... Yeah, you're not gonna care about my frost. That's frost, too. Damn it, why is everything frost? Dagger flames. Not gonna punch me. Wait, you're trying to heal. Denied. Denied. Alright, this is gonna get kind of annoying because just as I get all these frost things, I'm going to, uh. Let's talk to these guys. Are you here to end this nightmare? 
and free us all from the Savage Garden? Yeah, you could say that. Everyone here died in the Master's service. As the Master promised, we are now immortal, like the Daedra. But our life here is a nightmare. The creatures of the Garden torment us endlessly. When they kill us, we are soon reborn and the cycle begins again. No one has yet found a way to leave the Garden, except those few given the bands of the Chosen and allowed to enter the Forbidden Grotto. Yeah, you know what? I'm not going to talk about that stuff. It's pretty... I'll just explain it. Basically, the Forbidden Grotto, once they complete whatever task they have in here, they can... Uh... Oh, yep, yeah, here we go. That guy got killed. These guys aren't that powerful. Like, they can... I could probably kill them. See, look, they're actually getting chased over there by a Frosty. Frosty the Snowman. Now, what's my active quest? Okay. Not very helpful. It's been so long since I've done this. Oh yeah, I think I'm going the right way. That's right. Oh. You're gonna... Yeah. Thanks. I'll just deal with them. Whoa. Don't clap me. Don't punch me. My agility is really high. I don't know why he's knocking me off balance. It is impossible. <coughs> yeah, I got some alchemy to do. Um, let's see here. What can I make? Viper's bug loss. Nothing. What about bone meal? Resist fire? What? I don't... Yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna create it. Just because I can. You never know when you're gonna need some good old-fashioned... Resist fire. Oh yeah, this guy. Kathutet. You destroyed the Sigil Tower at Ganona. My kin say you fought well. Ganona? I've never heard of it. Our clan sacked your city of Kavach. A trifling task fit for scamps. Your swift retribution earned you much respect among my people. We had not expected that a mortal would act with such resolution and honor. It is no dishonor for us to speak. Okay. I seek make our camera. You speak directly, like one of my people almost. I'm glad I did not kill you immediately. What do you want then? There is but one way out of the garden. I guard that path. You will travel that path, and it will bring me honor to defeat you. But you shamed my kin at Kanona to bring you into my service. That would also bring me honor. So I offer you a choice. Would you confront me in battle? Or offer me service? Hmm. So battle, basically he attacks you. You can get it done quicker. Or... This one, service. This one's a bit more fun. So I'm gonna do service. An intriguing choice. And I have a task in mind that will test your wit and your loyalty. The rabble of the Savage Garden have imprisoned the Zivili Anaxes. I consider his humiliation a fitting punishment. However, his shame attaches to me, and though the matter is too small for my attention, it is not too small for one of my servants. Free Zephali and Axes, and I shall reward you with the key to the Forbidden Grotto, the Bands of the Chosen. Free the Zephali? Menka Cameron's chattels 
The unmortals that swarm here in the Savage Garden, their proper role is to test themselves in unceasing combat. But being no true immortals, they are without honor or courage and shy from battle. However, by some trick, they trapped one of my agents, the Zivili Anaxes, in a cave. They show initiative, and Anaxes doubtless deserves humiliation. But I cannot permit this to continue. Do me the service of freeing Anaxes, and I will reward you with the bands of the Chosen and passage to the Forbidden Grotto. Okay. So now we have to go free the civil eye. I find this pretty amusing. And plus, the Grimoire are pretty cool. They've got like their whole little honor system going. I can sort of respect that. They aren't just sort of mindless and destroying everything because they feel like it. Which is good enough for me. Wait. Oh, another one. Stop knocking me off balance, buddy. Yeah, that's right. Fly. Fly, bitch, fly. Yeah, these guys are gonna tell you to not. They're gonna be like, stop! Don't open that door! And I'm gonna open that door. Please, don't let Anaxes loose. He torments us night and day. The master's plan will have succeeded. Stop. D no. Get away from there. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. Anaxes is out, and Anaxes is pissed. He actually attacks you if you don't, if you try to follow him. So. I'm going to leave before- Wait, didn't I just kill you? There. You're dead again. Happy? Okay. Now that that's done. Well, it looks like... Yep. Another corpse. These guys really suck at fighting. Another... There. You're dead too. Yeah, the first time I did this, I turned out that Anaxes attacked me, and he was actually doing quite a bit of damage to me because I was just a mage, and uh, I had to kill him. And then Kathutet attacks you as well. Okay, where's where'd he go? Are you supposed to go in there? I'm pretty sure you're not allowed in and oh okay I guess you are allowed in <laughs> how far back did he go in here Oh, this is a nice little dagger I got here. It's pretty handy. Where is he? Okay. Anaxes is free. Order is restored to the Savage Garden. <coughs> you have served me well. In return for your service, I will give you the key to the Forbidden Grotto. If you still wish it. Give me this key. Take these bands of the Chosen, then. Wear them, or you cannot enter the Forbidden Grotto, the only way out of the Eternal Garden. Honor and pride bids me tell you. None can escape the Forbidden Grotto. 
There, you will be the charge of my kinsmen, or they. Forbidden Grotto. The one path from the Savage Garden is through the Forbidden Grotto. Only those wearing the bands of the Chosen are allowed to leave the Garden. Bands of the Chosen. At Mankar Cameron's command, a favored few are... You cannot pass through the door to the Forbidden Grotto. Yeah, okay. I know all that. How little you understand. You cannot stop your Dago. Uh, the principalities have sparkled as gems in the black... Reaches of Forgot. Gotta wear these. Oh, great. The Oblivion. Duck. Many are their names and the names of their masters. The Cold Harbor of Meridia. Periite's Quagmire. The Ten Moon Shadows of Mithala and. And Dawn's Beauty, the princedom of Lorcon, misnamed Tamriel by deluded mortals. Hmm. Uh oh. Yes, you understand now. That's right. I'll Tamriel is just I'll one more Daedric realm of oblivion. Long since lost to its prince, when he was uh, betrayed go. by those that served him. Lord Dagon cannot invade. You wear the bands, what? but you're no prisoner. To make our Who are you? What are you doing here? I'm here to kill Maker Cameron. Can you really do it? Can you bring this eternal nightmare to an end? Can you defeat Mankar Cameron and free all the souls of the poor fools who followed him? Listen. I can help you. You need my help if you are ever to leave the Forbidden Grotto. Why would you help me? I was at the sack of Kvach. They had no chance. We took them by surprise, and we carried the walls in the first assault. But they fought on anyway, desperately. They seemed to think this decadent, mundane world of theirs was worth defending. I was slain after the battle was over. Three townsfolk hiding in the cellar attacked me when I entered their house, hunting down survivors. They tore me to pieces, although I have no doubt they were immediately killed by my companions. I've had plenty of time to ponder my deeds since I came here. Ponder and regret. An eternity <coughs> of regret. <coughs> For my weakness, the Master sent me here to torture my former comrades, who showed similar ingratitude for his gift of eternal life. Hmm. What can you do to, How can... Uh, how can you help me? No one wearing the bands of the Chosen can leave this grotto. The doors will not open, and there is no other way out. I can remove them, but I will need time. The Dremora Overseer will be here any minute to check up on me. You need to play along until he leaves. Just act like a prisoner, and do as I say. Once Orthe leaves, we can find a quiet spot to remove these bands. Fine, I'll play along. Good. Follow me, and don't worry. You can trust me. Alright. And what is this thing that's being drained? Um... Drain health. Okay, is my health slowly going down, or what? Yeah. What's going on here? Who's this? I am a, a vampire. Sent in by... <laughs> Show me some respect, worm. Unless you want to end up in the cages with them. What's up? Yes, Kinreeve, sir. This prisoner was sent in by Cathetet for questioning. I was about to begin. This is not one of Mankar Cameron's chattels from the garden. Who is he? Nothing escapes your vigilance, Kinri. Capitet wondered as well. This is why he sent him for questioning. Well, carry on. Of course, Kinri. Prisoner, get in the cage. 
Oh no, I hope you do not pull the trigger or lever or something and put me in the lava. You're not actually going to do it, are you? Don't do it. Don't do it. I'm a wood elf. You can't do this. Wow. Oh. It's a little hot down here. Fire! 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 Uh, the heavy from Team Fortress 2. There's no way for me to cross, but the Master's immortality does have its uses. I will distract the Dramora for as long as I can. Okay. He'll distract the Dramora. I'll kill him. Oh, another one. There we go. Alright. Way to distract the Dramora there. Oh god, there's lots of Dramora. I may actually need to uh, play this safe. I probably should have been playing it safe. Alright, time for Elven Arrows. I like how these guys have names. None of the others did. Arthur's Key. Oh, Sorcery Potion. Could use that. Right now, in fact. Wait, what? Damn it. Ah, I didn't mean to do that. There we go. We are good to go. Sacrificial altar. <laughs> Let's sleep on the bloody sacrificial altar and my mouse just spazzed out there. Worthy's key again. Eldermuel, no! Alright, now how do I get out of here? Isn't this the way I came? It is. How do I leave? I've always had trouble at this part. Okay. This looks like a way out, but it's not. Now what? Hey, a head. Yummy. Daedroth teeth, they have useless powers. Okay, always nice to know. Oh, hello. I'm just warming up, you pathetic worm. Oh, back into the water. Back into the lava. That's right, that's right, that's right. Back away. I like how these guys always end up in the lava. Somehow. I'm gonna try to do this all in one episode. It might be a long episode. Because of both all the talking and you everything. You made it! I didn't think you'd have any trouble. Let's get these bands off you. There. You're not a prisoner of the Forbidden Grotto any longer. Let me come with you. Let me help you kill Mankar Cameron. I am not without power. Sure, I'd be glad of your help. I am no match for Mankar Cameron, but perhaps together we can find a way to defeat him. Lead on! Hmm. Well, another body between well uh, done, me champion. and... Uh, oh. Your progress is what now? swift and sure. Perhaps you will reach me after all. Damn straight. You think I mock you? Not at all. In your coming, I hear the footsteps of fate. You are the last defender of decadent Tamriel. I am the midwife of the mythic dawn, Tamriel Reborn. I welcome you, if you truly are the agent of fate. I tire of the self-styled heroes who set themselves in my path only to prove unworthy in the event. Hmm. 
so apparently I'm not the first to try to come, come here. <coughs> this may have to be continued next episode. Then again, people don't mind the long episodes, so... You know what, this might just be one whole episode. Better to get it all done. What now? For Tamriel. For Tamriel. That's odd to hear someone like him say. Show me what you got. This is the part where you fall yeah. down and bleed to death. Paralyze. Burden. Why not? <clears throat> Doesn't really matter if Eldamil dies, because he's immortal. Ooh. <laughs> oh. Okay, I need to recharge this thing. I think I brought some soul gems. Yep, I did. Hey. Okay. How convenient. Ah! This charge is 1,200 and it recharges 1,200. Okay. The pain redeems me! Okay. <laughs> he was alive one second and then just died. Okay. Well, I think he'll uh, meet up with you around the uh, end again if he dies in here. Miss. I'm just trying to get through this as fast as I can if you're wondering why I'm not using my wood elf archery skills. A civil eye. Is that it? Ooh, Claymore of Fire. Medrike. <coughs> Attacking me was a very uncivilized thing to do. Didunch. Haha, <laughs> I'm very bad puns. That was an awful pun. Oh, hello, you're back. Good. Nightshade plant. Nightshade, please give me nightshade. Yes. More nightshade. Need more nightshade. Nightshade! This is actually very useful. Damage health. I don't think I have anything else that I can use it with right now, but... We'll see. Oh, these things. Yeah, I'm just gonna edit this out while I search for supplies. Okay. Now... Ooh, Nightshade! Okay, I'm back. Ooh, not Nightshade? Okay. Okay, I think these are useful anyway. I'm not gonna take those. I probably should. Nightshade! I love you, Nightshade. Okay, something in my eye. Uh, my hair is ridiculously long. I should probably get a haircut, but I refuse. I'm just gonna get more Nightshade. Alright, so apparently if you wander too far off the path, uh, chasing after nightshade like some child in a candy store uh... it teleports you back to the entrance so oh there you are i thought i lost him anyways before i get distracted again oh which reminds me there we go time to deal with these guys one of which will be quite familiar 
You did not expect to see me again, did you? You have no grasp of the power that my father has at his command. I've beaten this game five times. I you know. think you can stop us? Soon, well, more than five, Dagon actually. will walk upon Tamriel for the first time since the Mythic Age, and our victory will be complete. Come. My father is waiting to welcome you to Karak Agayalor. <coughs> Oh yeah, this guy. I remember you. Can I kill you? You know what, I'm, I'm not gonna bother. Let's just get this over with. These guys will die when Cameron dies. Which will be soon. Let's see if I can make anything from that nightshade I got. 32 nightshade, nice. Oh, all I can get is burden. Burden's useless. Frost damage. I don't have frost salts. I mean, I. What? What happened to my frost salts? Wow. Okay. That's kind of annoying. I have waited a long time for you, champion of old Tamriel. You were the last gasp of a dying age. You breathed the stale air of false hope. Yeah, okay, you keep doing that. Let me just prepare my uh, weak poisons of silence I bought. How little you understand. You cannot stop Lord Dagon. The walls between our worlds are crumbling. The mythic dawn grows nearer with every rift in the firmament. Soon, very soon, the lines now blurred will be erased. Tamriel and Oblivion rejoined, the mythic age reborn. Lord Dagon shall walk Tamriel again. The world shall be remade. The new age shall rise from the ashes of the old. My vision shall be realized. Weakness will be purged from the world, and mortal and immortal alike purified in the refiner's fire. My long duel with the Septims is over, and I have the mastery. The Emperor is dead. The Amulet of Kings is mine. Not for long. And the last defender of the last ragged Septim stands before me, in the heart of my power. <laughs> What's the matter? You kind of silenced? Or are you... Oh, you absorbed it, didn't you? There we go. Didn't absorb that, now did you? Fate chose me well. Exactly. Exactly. Do you have anything of use for me? Don't fall on my head, please. Ooh, Grand Ring of ret 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 Retribution. Eldamil's dead, too. Haha. <laughs> you suck. Oh, God. Oh, boy. That almost hit me. Awesome. Do homage to Martin's champion. All me. All me, folks. You found a way back. Does this mean... Maker Cameron is dead. You did it. You defeated him. Then you have it. You have the Amulet of Kings. Here, the amulet belongs to you. Belongs to me? The Amulet of Kings? So you and Joffrey have said. If it is true, if the Emperor really was my father, then I should be able to wear it. Only those of the Septim blood can wear the Amulet of Kings. Put on the Amulet, Your Majesty. Yes, of course. What am I waiting what for? What are you waiting for? After all, this is my destiny. And no man can deny his destiny. You see, you are Uriel's son. I knew it. I didn't really need the Amulet to tell me that. I've known it was true since you first told me him back in Kavach. But it is one thing to talk of becoming Emperor, and quite another to actually be the Emperor. 
You are the Emperor. Not yet. Until we light the dragon fires, the gates are open, and Mayroon's Dagon's invasion continues. While you were gone, I sent a messenger to Chancellor Ricardo. He waits for us in the Imperial City. You'll have to wait till next episode. Why me, Ricardo? Stop frowning. I just killed a single person, and now he hates me. Sucks. Chancellor Ricardo is the head of the Elder Council. The Council rules in the Emperor's absence. I don't expect any objections from the Elder Council, but we should defer to their authority. Let's go to the Imperial City at once, before the enemy can recover from Manka Cameron's death. Alright, so before you do that, before we continue, this will have to continue next episode. So, um, yeah, it looks like we're almost done the game. I mean, what can possibly go wrong when we go over to the Imperial City? Hmm? So, remember to comment. Tell me what you think of this, uh, little... Tell me what you think of my, uh, commentating my episode. Whatever you want to comment about. As long as it's not first, or second, or third, or whatever. And, uh, thumbs up, thumbs down this video. And subscribe if you like my videos, and if you haven't already. And I will see you next episode. Thanks for watching.